Good morning. They certainly have gotten a lot easier to get. You can get them delivered straight to your home through a government website, a website that went live a day earlier than expected. For many in the medical field, it's about time. I think it's it's really important. Um, uh, uh, of course, we all would have liked this a month ago. That would have been a little bit better. Four free COVID tests delivered to each household is the latest weapon the Biden administration has pulled out to try and fight back COVID-19 in the highly contagious Omicron variant. We're looking forward to getting free tests out to the public. The government bought about a billion tests. You can sign up for your test by going through a dedicated USPS website or by visiting www.covidtest.com. Gov. Some of the first tests will be delivered later this month or early next month. The kits include four rapid antigen at home tests, not the PCR tests, which are considered the gold standard, but they can be taken anywhere with results in 30 minutes. They will work whether or not you have COVID-19 symptoms or whether you are up to date on your vaccines. It makes a huge difference in being able to keep those around you safe and, you know, just know if you have that little cold or bit of symptom to be able to do a, a test and know that it's negative or that it's positive. It helps inform you either way and, and helps you know what to do. Like with any program of this size, be aware of people trying to take advantage of you and steal your personal information, even by using fake caller IDs and websites. Saying we can get you on the list, we can get them faster to you, and we need your you know personal information or we need your credit card. That's all the government's going to ask for is your information, your mailing address, and an email if you want to be notified, and that's the extent of it. Any other personal information is not needed. Now, as far as signing up for the at-home test kits, the website is extremely easy and user-friendly. I did it yesterday. It took me less than five minutes to sign up and get my confirmation email sent to me. We're live in the newsroom. I'm Eric Runn, WGN News.